How's it going, gamers and goomans? It is your friendly neighborhood Maple Warlock. Yes, the Maple Warlock. That was terrible. And it's time for the Appalachian Daily Report. Yay! So we'll uh, <clears throat> we'll we'll jump right into it. Oh, I got somebody here in my camp. That's great. Uh, complete the event Path to Enlightenment. Well, naked. Uh, as far as I know, Path to Enlightenment now is a public event, so you get the notification at the top when it pops up, so that you can actually have time to get there now. So. Just keep an eye out for that to pop up, and then go do it naked. Shouldn't be that hard, because, I mean, it's just killing the fireflies. So unless you're really low level, so that the rad toads, or the odd ghoul that's up there might take a round out of you. But, I mean, it's in the forest, and it's pretty early on, so it shouldn't be that difficult. Craft healing items 5. We get this one a lot. If you watch these, you know. Go to White Spring Bunker, and you can buy them if you have access. Certain events around the map will award you some of these my when i was playing my on my alt yesterday i got uh i had got diluted rat away and diluted stim pack i think from doing the one in flatwoods whatever you call it fertile soil and then you can get also like various disease cures and stuff like that so you know it, they're they're not that tough to find deal critical hits to enemies in vault 94 5 get that vats up get them crits that's probably not that difficult, other than, you know, remembering to use your VATS. And if you're not a VATS build, sorry. <laughs> I, I used to not be one. It takes a long time to get your luck, with no luck, to get VATS built up. And if, But, you know, I've always had high perception, so then... There's that whole thing that I don't get a lot of shots in VATS, but they always usually hit anyway, so... Yeah. Destroy an Assaultron using a sword, we might go do that in a minute. Assaultrons, of course, there's a lot of them around Watoga, so they're easy to find. Uh, even if you've done mayor for a day so they're not hostile, you can still go and attack one and it'll count. You could also go to the White Spring, I suppose, but then that would get the entire White Spring turned on you and that's not fun. Well, unless you're into that. Uh, level up well, sunglasses, asylum uniform, wielding a sword, pick your favorites, get them done. I'll maybe work on these later with an alt because they're a little easier on him because this guy takes so long to level up now being over level 300. Survive in a storm for minute six in nuclear winter. So the storm is, oh, the closing ring. So start the match, run into the storm till you die, repeat until you get six minutes of it. You can stay out there for like almost a minute before it'll kill you. So it'll take like six minutes. Weeklies are the weeklies, you know, work on them. And atomic shop is, oh, well, hell, let's just do it now. And the Atomic Shop is the same as it's been all week, except now we have two days left on all the vending machines and the cultist stuff in the shop here. I'm assuming the bundle must be also on the same timer. And uh, scrap kit sale, I don't know. Two more days on the down home bundle, a couple more days on the poster and to get your lamp and all the other stuff they've got in here, the West Virginia tables, Mothman paints, a Mr. Pebbles lamp, the stairs, I kind of want those stairs, but I'm being cheap ass and not getting them. Because then I'll have to tear out the ones in my camp and put in new ones and uh, what a pain in the ass because it probably won't let me remove the stairs because then I won't have access to the next floor and I have to rebuild my whole camp and just what a headache. One more day on the Mothman statue, another day, two days on the weapons bench and the armor bench. So it must be a day on the Mothman poster and two more days on the camp bundle, which is a bunch of stuff I can't remember. Oh, water generators and oh yeah, that ugly yellow suit and all that fun stuff. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. So, we will make sure we have a sword, and then we're gonna go kill us an Assaultron. We got a sword? I still got the gutter, don't I? Do I not have the gutter on me anymore? I have meat cleavers. I have various tactical weapons. No, I don't actually have the gutter on me right now. Good thing I checked that. I was about two seconds from just running out the door to be like, I'm gonna kill me a dude! And I wouldn't have had the gutter. Is that really the best sword I have? I'm gonna take him out anyway, just... What other swords do I still have? Doll my inventory. Oh, I got this meteoric sword that I found a long time ago, but it's only level 30, and I've censored. They kind of remove the uh, special property of it, and I've never seen one since, so I just hang on to it, though, because it's cool. It's a cool black sword, so, you know, hot garbage. Daisy Cutter. Commander's Charge looks good, but I tried it last time, and it, it wasn't that great. The Blade of Bastet is just armor pen, right? Yeah. That thing ain't bad either. 78. I think gutter's still better. And black diamond, I waited till the end and I got a black diamond this level 45. Which is, you know, I only hold on to it just because it's funny. And also because, you know, the kiss song. Now it's going to be stuck in my head and i got to try not to sing it. Uh, word of warning. Cultist blades. Do not count as swords. Don't ask me why. I would think they would, but they do not count as swords. Same with the cultist daggers. Do not count as daggers. As like knives and daggers. you got to use 
Bowie knives or combat knives. It's it's most mysterious. Oh yeah, and this stuff's all in here for sale. Nobody's bought my executioner. Sad face. I love that gun. And then the rest of these are just garbage that I've found and put together. Anyway. Anyway, we're just wasting time. Let's get this over with. First things last. We're gonna make some healing items just so I don't forget about them. Blood pack. Glowing blood pack. Rad X doesn't count. Rad away. Stim pack. Diluted stim pack. Now we'll go sell a bunch of it, and then I'll just check my ammo dump before I go. Cool, no ammo to dump. The hell is first aid? Okay, what we're doing? Oh, we gotta go kill the Sultron. And of course, since I'm kind of a glutton for punishment, I'll try to beat him down with just the sword. I've done it before. I mean, it's not hard. Detecting sentient life. Alert level elevated. Okay, it's a little harder when you run up to him so you have no AP, but. Alright, alright. You too. Get out of here. Where'd you go? Give me them fusion cells. Actually, give me everything. I want it all! Oh my god. I love when the gun just shoots through him. Okay, so what else we got? Level up, deal critical hits. Yeah, nothing else I can really do. Dang. I didn't dang do. Well, I guess that makes for a short one today. Which means I'll have more time to do other stuff. Yay! So that's going to be it for today's video. Hope you guys uh, have some good luck with your challenges. And I'll see you all next time. Till then, I've been the Maple Warlock. As the Maple Warlock. Be good. Don't cheat. Cheers. A massive thank you to Texas Weeds for supporting the channel. It, it, it makes my black little heart all a flutter. Thank you. Thank you so much, my dude. Keep on keeping on.